single phase synchronous mission and universal motor three phase squirrel wheel motor with dial under winding and silent four three phase silent four generator like dc integrated mission also you can couple dc to dc experiments for hopkinson experiment so for the sample experiment we are connecting presently three phase ac integrated mission coupling to our dc integrated mission so connect to the This is to make the strong coupling between two chassis. Here it is locked, and in the other side also, opposite side also, there is same similar handle. This is coupler between two mo uh, motor. Tight with Allen keys. This is EMT1 panel, connect devolve starter, that's called, connect input of the EMT1 to EMT20, set RYB, connect output of the EMT20 to input of the EMT4, for RYB, connect EMT4 output, reface AC motor to the Three phase AC integrated mission, R phase, Y phase, and B phase, and connect three phase AC integrated mission in delta mode. The rotor, short the rotor, three rotors. So we are connecting DC uh, three phase AC integrated mission as a induction motor with delta loaded and coupling to DC integrated mission as a generator, shunt generator, output of the shunt generator connected to the load of the load panel in EMT-16. Main, main, main song by MCB, RYB will glow, connect a W1 starter, it will start LED will glow. Here EMT 20, you can measure the voltages of the three phase, R phase, Y phase and B phase. Here EMT 4 panel, reverse starter, you can connect the output of the EMT 4 via reverse starter switch, you can start switch. This is moving forward direction and other, other direction is reverse direction. So, this works as a motor, 
this is integrated mission. You see, this integrated mission works as a generator. Generator output of single phase, you can blow the 100 watt bulb. So, this is the experiment of the three phase induction motor delta loads to the DC shunt generator of single phase. Our electrical machine trainer rack is self-sufficient. All the load panels, three-phase, single-phase output, and DC output are available on only our rack. So no external things are not needed in our electrical machine trainer. All facilities, different loads, R, L, C are available in our train, including lamp loaders. So just purchase our electrical machine trainer is self-sufficient to run the experiment. Depends on your experience. 
cut this is one alternator alternator voltage is coming to input here you can see the voltage in EMP 20 to make it on this one generator is coming to here in synchroscope panel similar way this, this is another generator output is coming to here connector to on here so both the generators output voltage is coming to here this is three bright lamp method make it synchronize it on and connect synchroscope on synchronization voltage is coming here the output you can see the synchronization output here from 13, 14, 15 hence it is synchronized both the generators and the synchronization output has come to 13, 14 pin socket of the 26K. We are doing expand of synchronization, two bright lamp and one dark lamp method. To start with first generator we make on. first generator is on condition then connect the other generator also make it on condition so you can find out lamps are two bright and one dark method so when the position is come to three bulbs in two lamp two bright and one dark connect the switch synchronization mode so we found out there are two bright and one dark lamp method. The synchroscope is a steady condition. So hence it is synchronized in two bright, one dark method. This is called synchronization. 